What's up, guys? It's your boy, D ADHD Gaming. And I just want to show you a quick and dirty on my new favorite game, Zombie Land Double Tapper. So let's just go ahead and start out. I've gotten pretty far here. So I'm going to show you how to get through levels faster. So let's go to this area, for example. I'm like 96 waves out of 550. Click in there. Offline progress. Blah, 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 blah. All right. So you see here at the top, we have 10 nodes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And it's at 8. And then as it moves up, 9. It moves up again, 10, then resets to 1. So let's try to find these values. So I'm going to say 3 so I can get ahead of it. And now, I'll do 5 for the next node. Okay, now we're really narrowing them down. So they should be at 8. 9 and 10, and they should all reset to 1. Okay, so these didn't. This one didn't. So we'll go ahead and remove that from the list. Yes. Now, I'm just going to try to change some other values here to see if I can throw off the numbers. a little slow to update. So now that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to change all the numbers to 10, but I'm going to freeze them at 10. Because 10 is the last stage before you go to the next step. So I'm going to go change record, value, 10. And now, as you watch up here, you'll see it's at 101, 1, oops, I mean not oops, Good, it skipped two levels. Now it's at 103 to 104, 104 to 105, and so on. So instead of going up every single node, it skips 10 and 10 and 10 and 10 and over again. Um, the unfortunate part of this is that you have to search it every time with each new level, but it's super helpful in getting things done quickly. So there's that, that's skipping levels. So let's talk about getting our characters to do some super damage. So if you look down here, I have Tallahassee, and whatever this dude's name is. And right now, let's go ahead and do a new scan. And he's at level two right now. I'm gonna bring him up to three. Then I'm gonna search for three under four bytes. Okay, then we bring him up to four. I'll just click next a few times because it'll dwindle down. Try to bring him to five. Perfect. So we only have one address here for five. Now, the other thing you want to keep in mind is if you level them all the way up, you won't be able to use the skill points too. So here's something that I do. I just level them up as far as it will go. Okay, 13 is a good number to start at. So I will say, let's go and label this level. And then we'll go ahead and use a skill point here. So let's start by searching 13 available skill points. Alright, then we'll use a skill point upgrade. 12 skill points. Values are changing down here, that's why I'm doing next again. 
Upgrade again. 11. And we've narrowed it down. So this work is really fun. So I have 11 skill points available. Let's just change that to 200, which is more than enough. Upgrade, and there it is. It's been updated. Now, if you have a skill that you want to bring higher than it's supposed to be, you go to the skill and ideally bring it up to 2. Go new scan. First scan, 2. Next scan, 3. Next scan, 4. Okay. Still at 4, didn't change. Still at 4. Okay, and then we'll bring it up again. They all changed to 5. But I'm willing to bet this is the only relevant value because it matches the pattern of the one up here. Or, I'm sorry, the one here. So let's go ahead and change that to 500. And then we'll try to upgrade again. Boom, it's at 500 now. And the team's damage is now increased by 10,000%, which would not be, it would not be able to happen otherwise. So I'm gonna remove these values because they're irrelevant. Yeah, so is this one. Go ahead and cut that out. So we have Tella has skill points. And then sword skill. So now what we want to do is given that ultra damage and you always want to do the skill points first once you get the skill points then you can up the level so the level right now is at 14 I want them to be a little more powerful than that so let's just bring that up so 14 let's jack it up to 400 upgrade 400 and all of a sudden he's doing massive damage can't upgrade it anymore because it's way past where it should be. But that is just a quick tutorial on level by level basis. Um, I will come back with more. I have ways of um, upping the power of weapons and characters and stars and all that stuff and also manipulating daily goals to get more out of the daily goals. So I will check back in with you then. Hope this helps.